And people really say that this actually tastes like the Coke. Hell no. Nah. A portion of this video is sponsored by Dropbox. What is up you guys, welcome back. Today we're testing out some fun things that I've seen on the internet. A lot of these hacks that I see all the time going viral, I'm like, a lot of them are usually stupid, but a lot of them also work. Like I implement these hacks on the daily in my life. Like I always see things going viral on the internet and I'm literally always changing up like how I do my makeup, how I do my hair. I'm telling you, these are endless. Like the world is always coming up with new hacks and different ways to do things and I'm here for it, girl. TikTok got a chokehold on me, mama. All right, girlies, without further ado, let's get straight into these hacks. Okay, so I saw a hack on how to take better pictures. So most people would just take their pictures like this. But I saw a hack on how to get like the full scenery. I feel like this is just a good hack in general to like elongate your legs. It's using the panorama effect, but like this. So let me show you guys what I'm talking about. So typically I would just like pose, you know, like. <laughs> okay, these are kind of cute squish. So then we're gonna try the actual panorama effect I've been seeing on TikTok, girl. So this you pose and get the panorama. Okay, I look really short. We're having some issues. My husband doesn't know how to take pictures. What did you do? I don't know what I'm doing. Why is it keep doing that? Why do I look like that? It's just making me look wider. Okay, so I go straight up then. You have to hold your phone straight. Okay, hold like, it straight then. I'm trying to, it's hard. It, how would you take a picture when you do panor panorama like this? Hard. Okay, but try to do this. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like this is just a good hack in general to like elongate your legs. <laughs> This shit don't work. Oh, it doesn't work. It's not working for me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that one failed so bad, but I'm not gonna lie, like that gave me a good laugh. Like if you guys wanna try this, maybe I'm just doing it wrong. Like I genuinely thought that we were going slow enough and we were trying different ways, but like they just all came out so bad. You guys should definitely give it a try. I might even make like an actual TikTok out of this because that was really funny. Speaking of these photo hacks, y'all, I got a hack for you that has been so helpful for me. Thank you so much to Dropbox for sponsoring this portion of my video. As you guys know, Raul and I love taking pictures and videos of Mia. If we could capture every single move, we literally would. With that being said, all of my precious memories of my daughter Mia live on my computer and I'm constantly worried that I'll lose them if something happens to it. Luckily, I have discovered Dropbox Backup. Now I can back up literally everything and I don't have to worry about losing any of my photos. First of all, it was so easy to set up and whenever my computer is online, it automatically and safely backs up all of my photos and files. Sometimes I just wanna reminisce on all these beautiful moments that we've experienced and knowing that I can back everything up to Dropbox Backup and that all my photos are backed to the cloud, it gives me so much peace of mind. I would highly recommend it to you guys. Check the link in the description to choose your backup solution and start backing up all those pictures, girlies. Thank you so much to Dropbox for sponsoring this portion of my video. Also, I did do another hack that I did like this morning. I did my hair with some hair rollers. I went to CVS because I was like, they gotta have like these hot rollers, right? Because the hot rollers are all over the internet, but they only had like one size. So I bought whatever they had at CVS last night and I was like, I gotta try it. This is the one that I got at CVS. It came with these sizes. I'm putting them in my hair now. I did one side, it didn't take that long. I'm just gonna dampen up my hair. I just roll it in like that. Yeah, you see how now it's tucked underneath? Cool, cool, cool. Got it nice and tight in there. Bam. And I actually really like it. It's a vibe. It's like messy, but like fun and bouncy. And like the curls were a little tight, so I had to like really brush them out. But I would really, really recommend it to y'all because like my hair is going to stay curly. My hair is always falling flat because of the long extensions. But I'm living for it. I mean, she's big and bouncy, and we're here for it. TikTok, we love you, mama. Okay, we're trying the balloon boob moment I've seen these everywhere girl we have a shoelace and we just got these balloons and filled them up with water 
I want to make sure that they're even and not too low because if we tie them at the ends, mama, <laughs> mama. I know they'll be there one day, but she's only 28. I think like up here, right? Because then they're going to hang with like gravity more, literally. I'm sure it's mine, right? Hopefully. <gasps> so something like this, they're a little pointy, just a tad. Um, what's the word? It looks so natural. Okay. I feel like this looks so fake, and it's crazy because on TikTok, they look so real. I can't even do a full jump, girl. Oh, I mean, all this support on my back, girl. Now I get it when they're like, it's giving me back pain. There's so much weight. It's, it's breaking my neck, girl. Should I run like they do in the movies? Like, oh my god. Guys, uh, the big blue black egg for me. I'm sorry. It's hurting my back. I feel like I want to pop them. I can't do it like full force. They're gonna just pop on me. Oh, my back's killing me, girl. So I've been seeing this drink all over the internet, like everywhere. It's literally called the TikTok Starbucks drink. So y'all can order it. It's basically, okay, it's like a white mocha, but it's five pumps of white mocha, espresso, extra caramel drizzle, milk, ice, and vanilla sweet cream cold foam. That is how you order this drink. And I've seen it literally everywhere. I can't wait to try it. I love trying new drinks, girl. Mm. Okay, you know what? It's fantastic, but I think my caramel went to the bottom. I saw it, did you guys see that TikTok one where she was like, <laughs> I ain't risking that. There she is. <laughs> Dang, she's sweet. Mm. That's delicious actually. It's like addictingly sweet. It's delicious. I just don't know if I could finish this, girl. It's bomb, you should really try it out. I mean, there's a hype for a reason, like everybody's trying it. I just don't know if it's an everyday drink, girl. It's too sweet. <laughs> okay, y'all, so I have seen a lot of people use a lint roller on their dogs, like for shedding. Obviously they have like the brushes and all, girl. But I saw people doing it with this and like, it's crazy. I actually saw it specifically on a Corgi and I have a Corgi and you'll be like shocked at how much hair this shit takes out. So I really want to try it on Buns. Okay, so Buns is right here. She's actually shedding too. She's, yeah, it's shedding season. Look, just grabbing her. You see that? Oh my God, Buns, I feel like I'm gonna make you go bald, girl. I don't even know if this is a hack. I think I just saw it more like people were shocked at how much hair was taking off their dogs. Cause like she sheds a lot. Oh my God, this is like coated. I don't know how you, if you can see much of it, but. I can see it. Yeah. It's a lot. If you need an emergency and you want to really take your dog's hair off. No, you know what this would great work great for? If you have a lot of dog hair like on the bed maybe. Oh yeah. I know they have specific devices for this, but like if you really like cuz dogs and cats, especially cats, they'll be leaving like all this on your on your couch or like on your bed on your clothes. Obviously, it's kind of yeah. what it's for, lint roller. Yeah, I feel like instead of leaving it on the dog, maybe I should use it on the bed where it's going to leave a lot of <laughs> But if you're like desperate and your dog is shedding like crazy, I feel like this might do the trick for a bit. Okay, so I've been seeing this healthy version of a Coke everywhere, girl. People are split online. Some people say it tastes disgusting and it tastes nothing like Coke. And there's people that say it tastes exactly like the soda. So, so balsamic vinegar. Um, isn't there something else? Vinaigrette or what? It's the same thing. A vinaigrette is more of the salad for the salad. A vinaigrette um, already ready to go. This is also vinegar, for salads, right? It is. It's just um, more um, pure. Like it's literally okay. balsamic. Okay. Uh, we're gonna go in with some of this and some sparkling water cherry flavor because i saw the original uh, creator did it with cherry so i'm like you know what we gotta make sure we get this right because people are split online saying that it tastes either delicious and it tastes exactly like the soda and there's people that are saying that it's disgusting okay so we got some ice in here and we're just gonna pour in our sparkling water cherry blossom and it just smells nice because of the you know that hint of cherry for the vinegar, people were saying that if you add too little or too much, like you really will ruin it. So I really want to make sure I get this right. And people were saying that they use about, about like half a shot glass. So I'm going to take a tablespoon. 
I feel like this should be enough. Oh, ew, oh my God. It smells like a kombucha. And people really say that this actually tastes like the Coke, but. Hell no. Nah. Mm -mm. This is so disgusting. Like how do people actually think it tastes like, oh. <clears throat> there's no way that this tastes like the soda to y'all. Like there's no way. I followed it to the T. It's supposed to taste like Coke. Oh really? It looks like it's apple cider. It's supposed to taste exactly like Coke. Tastes nothing like Coke. I feel like the experiences that I've had in the past with kombucha have like turned my stomach there we so go. bad. It tastes like kombucha. I think it's disgusting. I think kombucha is so nasty. And this is giving kombucha, girl. I can't. Like, I can't. So now that we're in the kitchen, we're going to try this hack out using a can. And okay, it's literally just opening like the can, um, this, like the grip with a spoon and it sounds so dumb and unnecessary you're looking at me like if it's the dumbest thing you've heard no i feel like that's a hack that it's been around kind of. if you wear nails it's genius okay it is actually a hack for a lot of people that wear nails mama i don't have nails on today but that is the biggest annoying thing like opening cans with nails or picking up a coin like there's a lot of struggles when you got long nails girl and this is one of them bam like, come on. <laughs> so simple. And then you turn it around. And then you can go ahead and lift it with this. Who would have known? Also, I'm pretty sure this is cheese. <laughs> How old is this can of cheese, girl? When does it expire? I thought it was lechera, mama. And then I was like, this is cheese. <laughs> What's the expiration date on this, girl? I found it in the back of the pantry expired all right you guys i think that's all the hacks that i'm gonna be trying today that i saw on tiktok there is so many viral things online every single day they're getting so good though like they people are coming through if you guys know any really cool ones that you think i should try make sure to comment down below tag me on tiktoks send them to me through dm you already know girl thank you guys so much for watching i really hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did make sure to click that like button and i'll see you guys very soon in the next video